Hello, this is Tobias from Major Hunting. My guys has just started uh, skinning one of the, these big bulls, um, musk ox, probably about 10, 12 years old musk ox. Uh, they will tell you about what they're doing, so please watch. So uh, th uh, what we're doing now is we are opening up and uh, preparing to gut it or slaughter it because we want all the meat home but the customer of course wants the trophy so the trophy is the most important thing and what Andreas is doing is he's uh, cutting off the yeah the, the fur the skin and he's trying to remove as much fat as possible because that uh, the fat is rotting out here so that's why it, not, right now it's fresh and it's soft so now we have the chance to remove a lot of fat uh, before we get it to camp if we don't remove it now it will be very difficult uh, and it'll take hours to remove our hunter Bob he uh, wanted it to be a full mount so this is going to be cut in a way that as we said before the skin is going to be removed with all the fat then we're going to cut up here to get the hooves I think they're called and we have to keep the hooves on the skin so all the external part of the animal will be in one piece so we don't destroy anything so the taxidermist can uh, can fix it up really nice um, so you can't see any cuts or bruises on it so that would be step two and in the end of course we'll take the head completely off keep it with the rest of the skin with the hooves and everything and then we'll carry that out in one piece and then continue to slaughter the rest of the animal so we can get all the meat back home to camp okay now we're done with the the first part keeping yeah the first part of uh, removing the skin the hooves are off I guess if you can take it off again show so there it's still everything still in contact with the skin and the head so we're gonna remove the head now but first we're gonna to grip bias is gonna uh, got it open up the stomach he starts from here so he won't puncture it because it, it there gets uh, air in the stomach very fast so it can it can kind of implode or explode so he starts up here at the breastbone so he can has something hot to go down and then he takes out the stomach so the butchering can begin And what will happen to the meat? What will happen to the uh, intestines? All, all the meat are going to be used, so we have to carry everything out. And uh, yeah, so we'll simply butcher it, put it on our backs, take it down to the boats and sail it to the camp where we will smoke it, we'll make jerky out of it and use it in every way we can. Alright Thomas, so now it's taking off the head. The head, yeah. Tobias. The, yeah, Tobias is uh, skilled in this because he makes the cuts where you can't see it in the animal. So when the taxidermist will make it, you won't see any of the, the cuts. So we cut up, uh, what do you call that, under the chin. Hmm. Yeah. This is a throat. So Tobias just halfway through the neck and uh, he uh, made a very good cut because it's very important to hit the right joint and uh, the skilled people call it the atlas joint and um, the thing is with the muskox it can be very difficult because it's so has so much fat and meat and muscle around the neck so you really have to cut in the right place or else it can be a real pain to cut off this head but Tobias got it right and now we almost have the whole trophy off so uh, and then the carrying can begin. And now that the cape is finished, and we're going to carry it down to the camp, giving it a lot of salt. But the, the tough part is getting it down. Oh, uh, 
how much salt and how long will you be? We will, we will uh, cover it with salt uh, and we will change the salt maybe a couple of times and then have it out, not in the sun, but, but drying it as fast as we can. Uh, and the skull is gonna be recaped also. I'll sit for the next five hours and taking out the, the skull of the, the hide. So that's my job for the night. Tomorrow we take one more.